Hi, my name is Kevin with Koopman Rentals. Today we're going to be explaining the tow behind air compressor that is available for rent here at Koopman Lumber. There's a number of uses that this is rented for in our area. Um, if you were doing a deck project, things of that nature, and you ran into ledge and you needed to break up rock or ledge to install a footing or things of that nature. Also in the fall time, many landscapers and homeowners rent this for blowing out the irrigation lines of their sprinkler systems. Starting and running procedure of this machine is extremely easy. Uh, behind this cover you have your ignition and your start and run positions for the machine. With the air controls it doesn't matter if you have an airline hooked up to it or not for starting it as long as the valves are in the closed position. For starting it you want both valves in the closed position and you want the lever over to the start position. When you click it once to the start position you'll have a series of lights that come on. This is for your oil pressure and this is for your battery. The machine acknowledges that it does not have enough oil pressure right now. When the glow plug light goes off, then the machine is ready to be started. Once your machine is running, you can turn the lever from the start position down to the run position. Again, it does not matter if there's an airline hooked up to the fittings as long as the airlines are closed when the machine is running. When the machine starts, you'll hear it throttle up and then it'll level back to an idling position if these valves are not closed. As soon as you'd open one of the valves, the machine will sense that it's needing extra air and it'll throttle itself up to maintain the pressures. The air lines for this machine are stored on board and these are available for rental with the machine if you needed them. On the ends is what they call the Chicago fitting, which is a twist lock with a gasket in the middle. And You'll place it on, it's kind of a firm push, and then you'll quarter twist it, and it's locked onto the position. Same thing on your other end. As I said, these are available for rental with the machine if you were doing jackhammering or if you were blowing out your irrigation lines. We have a number of adapters that you can get to adapt to whatever you have for an irrigation system. This particular air compressor requires a pintle hitch setup. If you do not have a pintle hitch for your vehicle, you can rent one of these from Koopman Rentals. Um, they go into any receiver hitch of just about every truck on the market now. And for hooking up a pintle receiver, uh, you got your jack on this machine to lower it down onto your hitch. Once the weight is off of the jack, for this one to save you a little time, you can pull the pin out and flip your jack up out of the way and to close and lock down a pintle hitch. Then you have your two safety chains, one on each side. The chains should be crossed once so that if the trailer came undone, it creates a cradle for the hitch to land into in an emergency situation. Basic wiring, if you don't have this wiring on your vehicle, we also have adapters that can adapt to whatever vehicle you have for your lights, brake lights, and turn signals.